welcome to your weekly forecast. Now this is from March 10th until 16th. Let's take a look what's going to be coming your way. Oh, Leo. Mm -hmm. There will be some issues about money that you will be, you know, a little bit disappointed about. Actually, there is a s money source that you're expecting to come, but it's not going to come. Okay? And it has something to do with the child that is moving far away from someone who's like a father figure. It could be the actual father of the child. Uh... Um, which is, I feel like this, uh, you still have a lot of feelings for this person, but, you know, it's not really helping and it's not really doing any good because this feel, this person feels like they could, you know, abuse you and they could skip on their obligations, especially if you have a child together. So it's time for you to put your foot down. Because this person is splurging and spending their money onto someone else or something else instead of giving you whatever you deserve to have. The start of the week for you will be a little bit disappointing. You need, you know, there is also you need to proceed with caution with your, you know, with your decisions, with your way of thinking, with your mindset, especially if you are feeling a little bit. Um, you know, feeling a little bit um, annoyed or you feel like some other people are just taking advantage of you. But the thing here is you actually need some help, especially with, from your family members, friends or other, you know, or it could be your counselor. Okay. At this point, you're feeling a little bit walled up and you're trying to shut people out of your life just because that you feel like you're tired of being taken advantage of but that's not actually the case okay now you also feel lonely or sad or isolated or it's like why is it that nobody's there for me why is it that some other people have a good life or you know they're happy with their marriage with their family and stuff like that whereas i am always suffering um emotionally or when it comes to relationships so you will be feeling a little bit depressed and withdrawn, especially around Wednesday or Thursday. And uh, there are also some issues about the child, you know, that will be moving away or that, or that will say, I don't want to see my father anymore. Okay, or like, I don't, I don't care. Because, you know, the, uh, the responsibility of someone, well, more likely the father of your child, okay? And uh, it's already taking a toll on both of you. And... When they were younger, it's okay. You can create a lot of excuses. But, but now that they are slowly growing up and they are, you know, they are also seeing the uh, worth capability and, uh, you know, the attitude and behavior, or, you know, possibly the truth about their father, then this is the reason why they're going to be moving away or they're going to be, pu be, be pushing away. But the good thing here is they're going to, you know, like they're going to grow stronger matured uh well they will always feel like something is missing in their life and this will also create an imbalance and uh you know some psychological issues um if ever that the time comes that they'll be in a relationship this will be affecting them majorly okay so if you can talk to the father of the child or if there is something that you can discuss for the sake of your you know child together or children much better Okay, so that you will avoid further damage, emotional damage and mental damage in the near future. Now, an air sign that will be, you know, that has promised you something will be leaving you hanging in the middle. And uh, you know that it's time to just make a change. And uh, mm -hmm. you shouldn't have waited for this moment to come that this person is the one who will be rejecting you and now you don't even know what to do. You don't even know where to start because you have made promise, oh, sorry, this person have made your promise that they're gonna sort things out and that they will also be taking care of some of your uh, business stuff, financial, 
um, legal obligations and stuff like that. And then all of a sudden, they're just going to back off. And you don't even know where to ask for help for now. But then your family will be backing you up. And you will find yourself, well, reaching out and contacting this fire sign has been very, you know, acting like an ass. And, uh acting like uh like they don't have any responsibility or that they are single or that they are still like you know acting like a teenager more likely okay which is i feel like the reason why the two of you had had a fall out or the two of you had a divorce is because of their main attitude and they are very insecure okay now there will be some issues about the money that you will be dealing with or that you want to sit down and talk to this person but unfortunately i don't feel like you are going to be getting a very good feedback instead of feeling sorry and guilty about the situation they are going to make you feel bad and conscientious that you know they are you're trying to squeeze them for money despite of their you know like a uh, crisis and stuff like that but you know that it's all drama and uh, bs okay because it's not true that they are struggling in fact that they've been like going on a vacation and buying here and there in fact and you will also notice that they have a new phone or a new you know new set of things new shoes new clothes and stuff like that so don't believe what this person will be telling you okay you need to observe more for yourself and especially the lifestyle that they've been living and look at the uh, you know the obligation or look at your child that's been like missing that care and missing that support from their father so i also feel like this week you will think of either taking a holiday or calling sick for the last two days of the week okay right before weekends so that will be Thursday, Friday. And your family will be urging you to, you know, get married again. Find someone else to love you and to care for you and to, you know, take care of their responsibilities. But you feel like marriage is not just all about finding someone to take care of you. It's about somebody loving you for the, loving you for who you are and letting them take care of you if they really want to. It's not an obligation so i feel like you will you know stepping up and uh well by the end of the week i feel like you will be getting the money that you need um with regards to dealing with this fire sign around you uh well legally or something like that you know whatever it is that you need to deal with this fire sign just for them to give and provide whatever you know that they owe you because don't let this person get away with their responsibilities because i'm telling you it's not true that they are struggling they are living the kind of life that they really want to you know that they are living with so especially if they're already with somebody else who's a water sign or who's an earth sign uh. This person is definitely, you know, not really a good person to be around your your ex. Hmm. And you will also be feeling a little bit emotional and down around Thursday and Friday. And you will just cry all of a sudden. You will find yourself, um, well, crying or the tears are rolling down your face. And some people will also notice that you look so haggard or that you look a little bit uh, you know weary or that you haven't slept for uh, for a while so well it's gonna be one tough week for you leo so just try to hold on there okay so anyway that's it for you for this week and if you want to talk to me live in the phone the live day calls just go and visit me at my website at sophieangel.net blessings to you